Hey YouTube, it's the iPod Touch Guru here, and ever since the jailbreak came out, people have been wondering where my custom boot logo is, so I'm going to show you guys how to get them. Right now my iPod's in DFU mode, just wanted to do that. I'm already restored with the firmware, but I'm going to show you guys what to do. So you want to get two files, you want to get Red Johnny's uh, boot logos file, which will be in the video description, Exponent will be in the video description, and a custom, and the 2.2.1 firmware which is also in the video description um you have to all you also have to make sure that you drag like when you download the red johnny you'll get that right there the 2.2.1 bundle you definitely want that because that's what's going to get you custom boot logos so once you do all that you're going to want to create the firmware i'll also insert a code to the description that'll show you how to create the firmware you're also going to want Cywood's tool, so like that. You can create the firmware with that. It doesn't really matter. So I'm going to upload the DFU file. Put it down briefly here. So the screen's white. Upload that. Go to your next step. Just press paste. And this is just so your iPod can boot when you're ready. And then I'll show my custom boot logo. So you can see right there, it's inserting the command. It's very similar. Actually, you know what? It's identical to jailbreaking. It's just as easy, just with a different firmware bundle. So that's done. Patch DFU. And we're going to enter go. Once again, go. Oh, I hate when it does this. Sorry, guys. This is a defect sometimes. Jeez, I'm going to have to do the whole DFU process again. Pull my thumb down there. I'm plugging the plug to see if that does anything. Here, I'll try one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. screen. I'm sorry about that. That was, that happened the odd time. I'm gonna run these commands again. I'm sorry that this has to be done again. Might as well just show you in case you didn't understand a second time. You're running a few commands here. All you have to do is press paste. And I'm gonna have all these links in the video description. This whole thing again. Go. Ugh, it's gonna work this time. Yay. Exit. So now you're gonna wanna go to that right there. Go. On. go. And there's my custom boot logo, Ponage Pineapple, and I will be back to see how to change it. See you later, guys, and thanks for watching.